Hi everyone, Victor here. Um, yeah, let's talk about uh, this project right here, RPG. So if you go to my LinkedIn um, and click over here, explo let, let me read the title in Portuguese because I'm Brazilian. I, I bet you guys could tell by my bad English. Like explorando o uso de algoritmo genético em jogos digitais, something like exploring the use of genetic algorithm in digital games. So if you click there, you can see that uh, it links to my final thesis. I'm a software engineer. Uh, I did graduate uh, as a software engineer, and my final paper was on genetic algorithm especially in games, digital games. So I do talk about this project that I'm showing you guys here. Um, here's, here's a screenshot, a minified version. Um, and I talk about using genetic algorithm to create populations of interesting characters. You guys could read uh, this paper, um, but it's in Portuguese, I never took the time to translate it to English and I probably never will because um, each passing day I'm more and more busy uh, with a lot of personal projects but you guys could take a look, like this couple right here it generates like um, four kids and each kid has some trait of his parent um, here we have another population, another family, if you, if you guys um, and say like that like this one here uh, she has I'm gonna say she or he but don't 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 fight me on this please um, I I don't I don't want to get into all this uh, gender discussion so okay let's call this individuals uh, let's not uh, talk about gender or anything like that but this individual right here um, she has the skin color of this this individual the hair type of this individual and like she uses a spear uh, that indicates that she that it uh, is aggressive because um, it holds a spear it, it holds a weapon so it must be aggressive right and but the outfit is from this other parent here like uh, the outfit and the spear he inherit um, from this parent right here so you can read more about this on this paper I spent like f uh, f a whole year uh, working on this paper and like this other individual right here uh, then met, met this, uh, this individual right here and start a new population so the idea is, is that you have like all these people spread across the world and when they meet they can re reproduce and all this kind of stuff it's very interesting uh, you should take a look definitely take a look and here we have like a very very rough prototype okay so you start out naked uh, you don't have any clothes any hair and nothing um, it's just a I basically wrote this to um, capture screenshots for my paper <laughs> yeah it's very it's on a very early stage of development yeah I didn't find anyone on this world so let's create an, a new world uh, er, each, every time you enter the game or you reload uh, you create a new game for you a new world like here we have yeah and, and don't have collisions or anything like that you can just walk around to see like here we find uh, a character let's walk around to see if we find anyone else yeah another character so um, this game is this project is very ambitious because I would like to have a online version of a game where it's a unique experience for each player every time a player uh, logs into the game it creates a new world just for this player and it uh, has a lot of procedural generation stuff for the map and it's supposed to have like this um, artificial intelligence 
like I have here uh, another project that I was going to use I'm not even trying to explain this to you guys but uh, you can read a lot on this uh, on this page right here my github page you can learn about Gaia uh, generic artificial intelligence agent it's an agent um, yeah I, I'm not even going to try to explain because it's very confusing and I create this thing and I, I can't explain it to people but uh, yeah be my guest take a look and see what you think about but the goal of this project was to generate a unique experience a unique game with a lot of stories uh, emerging from the gameplay nothing is scripted everything happens naturally you can find this person and he could be this could be uh, yeah it's hard to say when it's hard to talk when you can acknowledge gender but yeah she has uh, long hair so I'm gonna call a she please don't fight me on this so let's suppose you find this this person right here and can um, interactive with her and or him I don't know and you can fight you can uh, help you can trade uh, you can reproduce with these people and generate another character um, yeah it's very hard to explain and I have this this project laying around for like two years uh, I did wrote this back in 2018 I uh, graduate back in 2019 so I've been working like crazy so uh, I, I I don't even know if I will have time and money and resources to, to just uh, sit and continue the development of this game so I just decided to make this video and show you guys uh, what it could be because I think it's very uh, interesting at least yeah I'm, I'm going to uh, share the link on the description of this video if it's if there is anyone interesting in this kind of stuff we can discuss in the comments yeah thank you for watching and yeah thank you see you guys soon bye